Holy shit balls of Nazareth. What the? Originality is being bad at being other people. It's just like completely unique. Everybody's got their own personality. Make people turn their head and go like, well, I've heard that before, but maybe not like that. There's more room for lightning in a bottle. I think you just know it when you hear it. Talking heads. I can't actually pinpoint what those guys came out of. I can't draw a thread back to another place. You know, the first Velvet Underground inspired everybody who heard them to start their own band. The early Sonny Curtis stuff is really killer guitar music. It totally changed my life. I think my first influence was, uh, was, was Larry Graham. Larry was the one with all the licks. Or Tom Petty, you know, it's like a American punch in, in the face. You know, all we can do is be inspired by it. I genuinely don't think I'd have bothered trying to play guitar if that, if that record hadn't existed. I don't really ask questions why people like the music I do, because I don't know why. I just, just keep doing it, you know? And that's how I think you become original. I've always just kind of been fascinated with the sonics of things. It tells as much a story as the notes or the lyrics of a song. I never want to do what people call hot. I would totally go like the opposite way. Even if I had a hit record, the next record would be completely different. I'd like to evolve and not repeat myself exactly. To try to draw from everything in the past and take all those ideas and, and try to form new things. You know, they say your instrument calls you. And I think the bass just called me. Like, if you have one of these in my neighborhood, you were like, you know, this means you have arrived. <laughs> The style and the, you're picking up a vibey relic. There were designs introduced that hopped up out of nowhere and they're still here. Anyways, what are we talking about again?